The new Modern Warfare 2 Season 5 roadmap, the official roadmap, just went live. And oh my god, this is hands down, without a doubt, the absolute best season we've had thus far. They should have dropped this during Season 2, but you know what? I'm not going to complain. I know you guys will be very excited because we are getting a ridiculous amount of DLC weapons, maps, operators, a bunch of content. We're going to go over all that in this video. So if you guys are excited, make sure you drop a like in the vid, subscribe to the channel, turn those post notifications, and let's get into it. Now, we're starting off with the DLC weapons because I'm not going to lie, y'all. These are looking amazing. We're getting a bunch of fan favorite guns and new weapons as well so i think we're gonna be really really happy about this first off we're getting the fr advancer i'm gonna go ahead and put a screenshot of that weapon on the screen right now this is the famas so the famas is making a return to modern warfare 2 I don't know about you guys, but I am really excited about this weapon. They leaked it a couple days ago. Now it is 110% confirmed coming to the game. This is probably going to be one of the best weapons because typically when they do bring in throwback weapons, they are quite good. So let me know down in the comment section what you guys think about this. Are you excited about the FR Advancer, aka the FAMAS, making a return to Modern Warfare 2 Season 5. Now, they have not specified if this is going to be a burst weapon or a full auto weapon just yet, but that information is probably going to come out within the next couple of hours to days. So, if it does, I'll make a pinned comment on this video. I'm really excited for this gun. I'm anticipating it to be an absolute monster. Now, the good news does not stop there. We also are getting a sniper rifle this season. Now, I was not, I was definitely not expecting a sniper rifle to drop within season five. I was only expecting an AR, a pistol, and potentially an SMG. Nah, that's actually not gonna happen. We are getting a sniper rifle. And this is actually going to be the Karak Point .300. This is gonna be pretty much the WA-2000 from Modern Warfare 2. 2009 making a return to this iteration now personally you know what I, I wasn't really a huge fan of the wa 2000 again i mean let me know down in the comment section what you guys think about this sniper i know some people loved it some people didn't it had that wonky kind of like you know troll where they had like the character kind of spitting his uh his tongue out you know on the scope but you know hopefully they go ahead and have that in this game but again semi-automatic sniper rifle pretty much one shot from the upper chest up so if you guys are snipers and looking for a new challenge something fun to go ahead and use and maybe not you know the intervention or some of the other guns that are in the game you can have some fun with the wa2000 aka the karak 300 so that's pretty cool but honestly this isn't what i'm really excited for we still have a, believe it or not we still have a bunch of other guns coming this season that i believe are really is me what puts this season above all of the others but again let me know down in the comment section what you guys think about this sniper now we are getting another assault rifle as well they are loading it up this season with a bunch of weapons we are getting the m13c this is going to be an ar we already have the m13b they're bringing in the m13c so that's kind of interesting here i'm gonna go ahead and put a screenshot on the screen right now this was actually kind of like the other weapon i was teasing previously the mcx rattler now they're gonna go ahead and call it the m13c so it looks like that leak was true but they went ahead and switched up the name so it's not the mcx rattler it's the m13 see now the good news doesn't end there because we are still getting more guns i'm happy to announce well they haven't actually announced the official name of this weapon just yet they probably will within the next couple of hours to days but i'm putting on the screen right now we are getting what it looks to be the og mp5 sd coming to modern warfare 2 season 5 this is the submachine gun we're getting this season i was not telling you this right now I was not expecting this to come out, but I'm not going to lie, y'all. I am unbelievably hyped for this. I was really under the impression we were going to get some, you know, <laughs> a handgun and an AR we already had in game. But nah, they're literally blowing it out the water with this season. So I'm super excited for this. We have the FAMAS, WA-2000. We have the M13C, the MP5SD, and 
we are getting what it seems to be the 1911 pistol the scatado scatado 2011 pistol some variation of that i'm gonna go ahead and put a screenshot on the screen right now for you guys they have everything kind of blurred out on the roadmap but we are getting those weapons coming within season five five guns confirmed this season and there probably are still going to be some melee weapons as well so this season is looking unbelievable so far definitely without a doubt the absolute best season we've had so far as far as dlc weapons goes let me know down in the comment section if you guys are excited because i'm telling you guys this right now i cannot wait to use the famas and also that new mp5 and quite honestly the pistol too because you know if they're bringing in a pistol it's probably gonna be like a two-shot kill monster so we're gonna go crazy with that now we are getting a bunch of maps this season as well and we are getting some remake maps so this is gonna be super good we are getting three 6v6 maps these are maps we can go ahead and have fun on multiplayer and we are getting punta mar i'm gonna go ahead and put a screenshot of that map on the screen you guys take a look at i've actually don't really have an idea of what this kind of looks like honestly it looks like yemen from black ops 2 that's the vibes i'm getting let me know down in the comment section what you guys think but putamar is coming to modern warfare 2 this should be a close to medium range map or at least i hope it is a close to medium range map we'll probably get the detailed blog like i said within the next couple of days kind of detailing how this map should in theory go ahead and play in multiplayer but you know what i'm not going to complain we are getting a new 6v6 map now we are getting strike strike is also coming back this is an original cod 4 map coming to modern warfare 2 season 5 so strike is making a return which again i am absolutely not going to complain about let me know down in the comment section what you guys think about strike this is probably going to be one of the better maps released within season 5 because typically the track record for the og maps coming to you know the newer call of duties they always play pretty well now i'm under the assumption that all of the original modern warfare 2 maps not the cod 4 maps but the Modern Warfare 2 maps from 2009 they're probably going to save all those until modern warfare 3 releases so right now we're going to be stuck with the original cod 4 maps which in all reality really aren't that bad i'm under the assumption that they're probably going to bring us like countdown and some of the those maps from cod 4 i think countdown actually might play quite well on mw2 so i'm really excited to go ahead and get my hands on this play strike definitely a pretty interesting map this is going to be one of the, the bigger maps i'm going to say for this game but in all reality it probably should play pretty decent but that's not it we also are getting a third dlc map which is actually ridiculous man we are getting drc this is going to be a 6v6 map as well go ahead and put a screenshot on the screen of what this gun uh, excuse me not gun <laughs> we're getting so many guns and maps it's getting crazy which is a good thing putting a screenshot of what this map is going to look like on the screen right now um honestly i don't really know what this is this is probably going to be their you know true original map that we have not seen or something that hasn't been modeled off of an existing model uh from a previous call of duty so again let me know down in the comment section what you guys think about this map definitely interesting not gonna hate any of these till i actually go ahead and have hands on but i'm telling you this right now that the guns this season are going to make up for whatever they're bringing in so i am super excited about this the maps they're checking out the guns they're definitely checking out but again <laughs> i can't believe i'm saying this the good news doesn't stop here now as far as operators coming to season five we are getting a bunch of operators and honestly some surprise operators that i would have never and i repeat never thought would come to a call of duty game we are getting oz he is me part of the battle pass i'm gonna go ahead and put a screenshot of him on the screen right now if you guys to check out definitely a cool looking dude but again he's not really what i'm excited for we are getting graves he is returning into modern warfare 2 season 5 putting a screenshot of him on the screen right now before all this information did drop i would say graves is what i'm really excited for but believe it or not he's actually not uh graves is coming uh we have arthur he is part of the black cell this looks absolutely amazing this is sick i'm putting a screenshot of him on the screen now for you to check out i think everybody is going to be buying the black cell this season because he is 
he's badass it's simply just bad i mean look at what the skin oh my god it's disgusting man we are getting mila she is going to be returning uh i guess from the raids into season five I'm gonna go ahead and put a screenshot of her on the screen for you guys to take a look at and we are going to be getting velikin he's me coming back to modern warfare 2 we saw velikin in modern warfare 2019 he's going to be making a return within modern Warfare 2 so i'm gonna go ahead and put a screenshot of him on the screen right now for you guys to go ahead and take a look at man definitely some pretty cool offerings we're getting within season five but again this 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 believe it or not isn't actually like the main deal operators we're getting we are still getting some pretty interesting content this season if i say so myself now here's where things get just insane and i mean absolutely insane we are getting snoop dog as an operator coming within season five i would not have expected this man again let me know down in the comment section what you think about snoop dog i'm putting a picture of what he's gonna look like on the screen right now for you guys to check out definitely a pretty interesting i guess collaboration we're also getting Nicki minaj coming within modern warfare 2 season 5 um yeah i would never have expected this it looks cool i ain't gonna lie i'm gonna buy the bundle so she is coming to the game take a look at it definitely pretty unique and uh <laughs> we are also getting 21 savage as well within modern warfare 2 um yeah this season is crazy absolutely crazy i'm putting a screenshot well actually it's kind of blurred out right now but i will put the silhouette of what his awkward will look like on the screen right now for you to check out we're also getting mace but at the end of the day i don't think anybody cares about mace anymore this is hands down the craziest season we've gotten so far man um season six i can't wait to see what they're doing within season six and then actually you know after season six we'll be geared up ready for modern warfare three so whew, this season's crazy definitely without a doubt the absolute best season we've gotten so far i wish this was actually like season three not season five but hell it is what it is if you guys enjoy if you guys are excited make sure you drop a like on the video subscribe to the channel turn those post notifications the dlc weapons 100 check out so i'm really excited for season five cannot wait to go ahead and get my hands on this content and make some videos for you guys oh my gosh this is 